Hi, I'm Mike Jared. I'm a, a, car, a global dairy technology manager with Cargill, working out of uh, Minneapolis in the U.S., uh, but uh, work across the globe in the dairy industry. So as we start looking at uh, the different farms, what do they have? They have different systems, you know, different equipment uh, manufacturers, different software systems, different types of software. So it could be production management software, it could be feeding management software. Um, with all these different systems, the one another challenge becomes uh, becoming an expert in each one to be able to really go through and evaluate the data that they want to look at. Uh, with the different platforms, how can they more effectively get that information earlier, become much more proactive with it, and, uh, and then be able to actually benchmark and compare across systems where we may have some slight differences in the way things are calculated or outputs are a little bit different. So we really uh, need to deal with that challenge of, of being able to understand how multiple systems help us understand comparisons between farms. So at the moment, as we start looking toward the future, we're actually working on a new platform uh, called Dairy Intelligent that is going to be a way to uh, really consolidate the data on farm to make better decisions with that. So that will range from pulling data from the farm, from the systems themselves, consolidating them, cleaning that data, and um, actually making sure that we have comparable numbers for easier benchmarking comparison. In addition, we want to be able to pull together the information that we already have that we're dealing with on the nutritional side from the diets that we're creating, uh, from the lab analysis results that we're doing, from all of that work, uh, and then more seamlessly tie that together with the walkthrough data, the eyes and the ears of that advisor to provide them with the best information possible to make real data-driven decisions that allow them to be much more proactive on what they're doing. So one of the opportunities that certainly certainly exists with this is that uh, you know we're, we continue to hear the term big data and dealing with uh, larger analytics and, and all of that terminology, but in today's world of agriculture, especially in the, uh, the dairy side, we don't tend to operate that way. There's a lot of data, there's mountains of data on each individual farm. But when we start talking big data, that, that's a term that means huge, huge amounts of data, much more than we think about typically on an individual location. So at some point, in order for us to really be able to take the advantage, the power of big data, it means that we're going to have to pull data from multiple operations and start doing the analytics across very large sets of information that allow us to draw conclusions that we just can't get to today.